Hi, I'm Roxanne Wolf. Dang, girl. If you weren't a figment of my imagination, I'd want to have your baby. And if a figment of our collective imagination, she will stay. Because this is the real world. We live in reality. Taxes and disappointment. It's a scam that we did not consent to joining. I hate it. All right, Billy. It's time you learn about money and the importance of... Huh, Billy, no! Fursuit. Yeah, um, not to get in the way of uh, young furries fun, but wouldn't it be kind of a bad investment to buy a fursuit when you're still gonna be doing a bit more growing in the future? I mean, yeah, I, I get it. Fursuits are expensive, and getting a custom-made one for your size when you're still a tiny little baby is a bad idea. But hey, you know, it, 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 that's just my opinion, you know? You don't have to listen to it. My body is a machine that turns dicks into sucked dicks. Oh yeah? <laughs> is that so? Prove it. And rats make me crazy. Crazy? I was crazy once. They put me in a room. A rubber room. A rubber room with rats. And rats make me crazy. Crazy? I was crazy once. They put me in a room. A rubber room. With rats. The rats make me crazy. Crazy? I was crazy once. They put me in a room. A rubber room. A rubber room with rats. And rats make me crazy. Cra <laughs> Bet you didn't think I was going to be in this video, now did you? Unless my name is in the title. Unless you can't read. Never mind. On to some memes. Making their fursona as sexy as possible, most furries. Fursona that's just me as a lynx. Me. I can kinda relate to the first one. When I created Barley, I wanted to make him as appealing to the masses as possible, so he just became Big Buff Cat Dad. And let's be honest, everybody loves a Big Buff Cat Dad. But for me, Barley isn't so me, per se. Barley is more an extension of my creativity, which has me thinking I should probably make a persona that's more based around me. What part of this emoji do you not get? I am in love with you! Just foaming at the mouth waiting for a response. I've been there before. But, take your time with people, make sure you're both comfortable with it, and then do something. Hi, you're a furry, right? Does it mean that you're gay? Actually, not all furries must be gay. I'm gay because I like dicks. I can, uh... I can relate. <laughs> Nobody can deny that the furry fandom is primarily filled with people who are in the LGBTQ community, but that doesn't necessarily mean that there aren't straight furries. There are plenty of straight furries. I see you. I know you exist. And you're valid. Stop kissing me. The more you do it, the more I like it, so stop! Yeah, totally don't stop kissing me. I don't like it. No, ah. Uh, no, no, don't kiss me. No. Stop. <laughs> Baby, bae, honey, wake up. Babe, wakey. Hmm. I wanted to tell you, yes? Move aside and stop hogging the covers, you greedy blanket stealing shit. Ah! Thanks for having me, Mr. Cook Boss. I have a little bit of morning voice right now, so hopefully you and your audience can bear with it. Anyway, subscribe to Barley the Cat on YouTube. Bye. No, don't kill yourself. You're so sexy. Ah ha ha. You know, if I ever find myself in a position where I'd want to end it at all, just, you know, get me a werewolf daddy to call me sexy and I'll probably snap out of it. You know, I... it might work. Maybe. I don't know. Hmm. Soup, roasts, salad is enough. Don't forget, sweetie. Feed him as much as you love him. Grandma. Oh, a few hours later. <laughs> you're home. Okay, yeah, that's amazing and all, but... Um, that's romantic, I guess. But you also wasted a crap ton of food. You're gonna do that? In this economy? Really? Oh my god, this Aiden Fox. Oh no. If furries came with a warning tag, what would yours say? Uh, mine would probably say, We'll glomp you unexpectedly, please bring cheesecake to disengage. And others might say, Too horny, bring lube, and nipple vibes. And they'd be kinda right. That's not what I meant when I said I like large cat sonas. And I failed to see that problem here. Do you see a problem here? I don't see a problem here. Bigger belly means bigger hugs and bigger cuddles. If you don't want it, I'll take them off your hands. Mm, yes, big kitty, big pillow at night, big cuddles at night. Oh, yes. <laughs>
It doesn't matter what you say to him. It'll be all right as long as your words come from here. M my nipple? Your nipple? Yes, your nipple, Amicus. You know, Amicus, you're lucky that you're cute. Otherwise, no woman or no twink would be able to stay so long as Marco has with you. Well, I mean... <laughs> It's um, it's no secret that the man's nipple, or scientifically known as the male areola, can be the strongest arsenal in a man's ability to attract a mate. It works on me. By the depths of Anubis, it's gonna work on you too. My flowers are dead. It's all my fault. Yeah. Ah, it's okay. I don't blame you for being an idiot. Uh, what the frick? The audacity, sir. I shall not stand for this mockery. You shall play with your blood. Play. <laughs> you shall pay with your blood. And maybe a bit of your sperm, but mostly your blood. My pecs are better. Clearly, my boobs are superior. Uh, guys, I, I can't breathe. I think we all know who the clear winner is here. It's this guy. These two can argue all they want so long as they stay in place. But this little panda guy here is the clear winner. I'm so freaking jealous. We're all nasty hoes here. Impregnate me, daddy. Yeah, so is me and probably a portion of the furry fandom. Welcome to the club. We can't hold orgies because everyone lives too far from each other, but we can send nudes consensually. Of course, that's a very important part. POV, me being a cat boy and avoiding my taxes. I'm a bear boy. My life is filled with microtransactions, including taxes. <laughs> Lucky son of a bitch. Not safe for work furry artists when they realize that kangaroos have three vajujays and echidnas have four dicks. This is like the most fudged up math problem that got emitted from Australian textbooks. It's like, if a kangaroo has three mappy tashis and an echidna has four dongas, how fast can an echidna get a kangaroo pregnant? And on behalf of my Australian viewers, if I had any, I would like to apologize for that atrocious attempt at attempting your accent. You like sniffing bear girls, don't you? Do I love sniffing bear girls? Do I love sniffing bear girls, she says. <laughs> yes. Yes, I do. I'm a proud sniffer of bear girls. Don't get me wrong, I like the musk of bear boys as well, but bear girl musk is a thing too. I believe they're not as appreciated as much. Give me that bear musk, mama. I... Mm, <laughs> I hate myself. Oh, I hate myself. I have two sides. Horny fanboy coyote and sciencey fanboy coyote. And one of them is just as sexy as the other. Hi, I'm Cookboss88. I'm here to tell you, yeah, you, the one that's watching this video. You are schmexy as hell. Do not forget that. Mm, yes. Hey, uh, do you like wanna cuddle or something? I, I don't know. Aw, oh, sweetheart. You don't have to ask me if you wanna cuddle. Just throw me over your shoulder and let me know that way. I'm a single, I'm a simple bear. Oh, I'm a single bear as well, but I'm also a simple bear. You know, I'll get the message. You know, I'm, I'm a very simple way of life kind of bear. Just tap me on the shoulder and just hoist me over your shoulder. Yeah, just <laughs> let me know if you want to cuddle sometime. Mm, yes.